My name is Clint Taylor from Texas Kayak Fisher and Trail4Runner.com. Today, we will be installing and reviewing the OEM Audio Plus door speakers for a 5th Gen Toyota 4Runner. Starting at the driver's side front door, remove the plastic covers to gain access to the screws that hold the door panel in place. You can then remove these screws with a Phillips head screwdriver. Remove the upper door panel and the lower door panel by prying at the edges with your hands. This may take a little bit of force, but just take your time and slowly work your way around the panel so you can remove it. While holding on to the door panel, unplug the wiring harnesses and the cables that go to the door mechanism. Begin removing the factory door speaker with a socket wrench. There are four total bolts that hold the speaker in place. Be sure to unplug the wiring harness before completely taking away the speaker. You should now be ready to install the OEM Audio Plus door speaker. Do so by installing the four bolts with a socket wrench and then plugging in the door speaker to the factory wiring harness. I used some zip ties and some adhesive mounts to cleanly route the wiring harness and help prevent any rattling once I reinstalled the door panel. Now that you have the speaker installed, go ahead and replace the factory door panel by first installing the cables for the door mechanism and the wiring harness for the lights to the door panel. Reinstall the door panel and press around the edge of the door panel to secure all clips in place. Last, reinstall all the screws and replace the covers to these screws and you're done with the front doors. The installation process for the rear door speakers is near identical to the front. Begin by removing the covers that hide the screws that secure the door panel in place, then remove these screws with a Phillips head screwdriver. Begin prying at the edge of the door panel just like on the front to remove the door panel away from the door. Unplug the factory wiring harness and the cables that operate the door mechanism. Begin removing the speaker with a socket wrench just like was done in the front. The only difference is the rear door speakers only have three bolts instead of four. Unplug the factory wiring harness to the door speaker and then carefully remove the door speaker. You can now install the OEM Audio Plus rear door speakers. Secure these door speakers with three bolts and then plug in the factory wiring harness to the OEM Audio Plus rear door speakers. After this, plug back in the factory wiring harness to the door panel, the cables for the door mechanism, and reinstall the door panel and you're done for the OEM Audio Plus rear speaker install process. Moving back to the cargo door area, remove the cover that holds the bolt that secures the factory grab handle in place. Use a socket wrench to loosen and remove this bolt and grab handle. You can now remove the two dome lights with a plastic pry tool and then disconnect the wiring to the back of these dome lights. After doing so, you're ready to remove the rear panel. You will use the same process you did on the front doors by prying at the edges and then pushing forward to remove the panel. Disconnect the wiring harness from the factory door speaker and then remove the door speaker with a socket wrench. You can now install the OEM Audio Plus door speaker by securing it in place with the three factory screws and then plugging in the wiring harness. After this, go ahead and reinstall the panel, the dome lights, the grab handle, and you're done with the install process. Okay, so we got the OEM Audio Plus tweeters, DSP amplifier, subwoofer, and door speakers all installed. How does it sound? Simply put, I mean, it's pretty doggone amazing. Uh, I can't speak enough about the DSP amplifier and how it, you know, tunes the sound specifically for your 4Runner, whether you have cloth or leather seats, 
you have third row seating, what type of head unit you have. I mean, it really just does an unbelievable job and that's something you're not gonna find in practically any other system on the market. And together as a complete package, the OEM Audio Plus system is just unbelievable and it's well worth the money. And in this video specifically, we covered the door speakers and they added so much mid-range quality and tone and volume, it really is impressive. And that's just the best way I can describe it is the, the mid-range that they add is truly remarkable. The tweeters kind of covered the high end, the subwoofer covered the low end, and these door speakers kind of fit in the middle range and they do a great job at it. They provide some, you know, uh, lower end bass tones, but they also provide the higher end and they just do an incredible job of really blending all the sound together and providing the overall, overall speaker sound from this system. Uh, one of my favorite things is sitting in the rear of the Forerunner, you know, with my lawn chairs underneath the cargo door when it's opened up and the new door speakers from OEM Audio Plus in that cargo door are just incredible combined with the sounds coming from the subwoofer. I mean, it really just is an awesome system. And so if you're on the market for a complete system toned specifically for your Forerunner, this is the one for you. It's going to be hard, maybe even impossible to find another system on the market at this price range, at this quality, that's going to be that good for your 5th Gen Forerunner. I hope this video was helpful for you. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to comment. Thank you.